Hello you guys, welcome to this edition of Cooking with Talisha's Kitchen. Today on the menu, I'm going to show you how to make Cajun pasta. You can use any meat. Today I'm using chicken, but you can use fish, you can use lamb chop, whatever meat you chose to put on the top is just fine. Very simple, easy recipe. What you will need for this is, I'm going to use panini noodles. You can use any noodles. I got the water boiling for the noodles. You will need some he heavy whipping cream, your seasons. I like garlic powder, onion powder, seasoning salt. You need your Cajun seasoning, black pepper. You also need cream cheese, butter, and you also need some cheese. So we're gonna go ahead, I'll grab the cheese in a minute. We can go ahead and just season the chicken breast. Okay, we have our chicken breast in a pan. You can go ahead and season it. Use whatever seasons you like. I like garlic powder, onion powder. Like I said, seasoning salt, black pepper, Cajun seasoning, and also a little mustard. Then you season your food with mustard and taste good. So you can go ahead and rub this in. Make sure it's all together. So you're gonna get you a, a skillet so we can cook this. And we're also gonna add um, some sausages to it and make it taste good. So we're gonna add sausages. And here we have our sausage. I usually just cut them. And you just kind of like tilt the, tilt the knife and cut them. If you want them to look like this or however you choose to cut them, it doesn't matter. So we're gonna go ahead and turn on this, this skillet. Add a little butter in here. And go ahead and place your um, chicken breast in there. Go ahead and finish cutting this up. Cause we're gonna add this in, in there too as well. So we have our chicken breast in here. I like to make some little lines in here just to make it look cute. So just cut you, don't go all the way down, just cut you some lines going straight across. And I'm just cooking this in butter. And it's over. You know, chicken don't take too long. So I'm gonna go ahead and add the sausages in here as well. Cook this all the way until it's done, which I'll show you how to look when we come back. So go ahead and finish cooking your chicken until it's all the way done. Okay, now that we're back, I still have the chicken over there cooking. We're going to go ahead and make the sauce. So you need about, I'll say about two, two cups of heavy whipping cream, just like a spoon full of um, cream cheese. And like a spoonful of butter. And we want to let all this mix because you want to um, bring this to a boil. I'm going to go ahead and season it. Season and salt. The Cajun seasoning. And don't forget, when you rinse your noodles off, make sure you rinse them in cold water. Okay, some seasoning. Add a little paprika in here. This will give it like a little dark color. And garlic powder. You're gonna add in your grated, you got to make sure this boiling too, to add in your the grated um, Parmesan cheese. Okay, 
then go ahead and add in your noodles. That was about, I want a cup of noodles. Now we're gonna take the sauces out of there and add it in there too. But the chicken is still cooking, because I like mine's a little dark. Now we're gonna add the white cheese. I use, this is a mixture of mozzarella and provolone. Go ahead and just add that in there. Just a couple sprinkles up at, at the top. And go ahead and mix this all up. Now it's gonna thicken up. Go ahead and mix it all together. Sometimes you might have to add a little bit more heavy whipping cream just to loosen it up just a little bit. But you don't want it too loose. Go ahead and um, add this to your plate. That is so cheesy and good. We'll clean it up afterwards. Don't worry about it. You probably don't even need that much noodles. See, I got enough. Go ahead and add your chicken breast to the top. Sprinkle over some parsley flakes and here you go with your ch chicken sausage Cajun pasta. Oh my God, it is so delicious. You can eat it with corn on a cob, garlic bread, however you like it. Let me know how y'all cook y'all Cajun chicken sausage pasta dish. And let me know if you tried mine. Let me know how y'all like it. Thank you for tuning in with this edition of Cooking with Talisha's Kitchen. Thank you all. Oh, make sure you subscribe and share. Thank you all and have a blessed day.